Yo, what it do YouTube, it's me, Can't Stop a Money, and we are back inside the Hyper Butter Reaction Chamber, and this is another reaction to Fire Force. Yes, this is Fire Force Episode 9. Alright guys, so coming off of Episode 8, that that wonderful, amazing Episode 8, that that that, that great, ep epic, feels, in the feels Episode 8, man. Rekka, Rekka, one of uh, Captain Burns' is, uh underling lieutenants or whatever you want to say yeah man he he was he's one of the ones behind the cause of infernals you know well you know he just got that he got he got the bug the way to have infernals happen yeah the person gets to put the bug in front of the tube puts it up to their body the bug goes in and turns into infernal um uh, so yeah that's no telling how long rick has been doing that probably just recently but uh, we're gonna come. We're gonna get to the bottom of that, man. I, I like at the end of it. I really, have, I was really feeling feeling some type of way for uh, for Tamaki because you know Tamaki liked Rekka, and Rekka just turned to be a, this crazy this this crazy guy that just wants to find using children, using children to find to try to find somebody compatible with the pilot light. That's what he said. Whatever that, whatever the pilot light is, we don't know what that is yet. But uh, yeah. So you no know, turning children into infernals or hell it was one guy it was one little kid uh it was a little boy that actually made it through and uh you know his eyes little like he's turned into one of the well, like probably like a second generation or something like that maybe a third generation that's what it seemed like but uh yeah so he's compatible with it and you know Shin shinra the emotions at the end of that time that that tamaki was showing you know because she really liked him she just crying out for help uh she used her power uh, uh shinra has sensed it came through with such like a Batman like entrance and sit there and curb stomp his face in. Oh, get hyped just thinking about that. Let's see what happens next guys. And just a, a wonderful emotional uh, scene at the end. Uh, definitely animated too of Tomika crying, but like, you know, she, she, she sobered up a little bit and then she just smiled. You can see at the end. So let's go ahead and see what happens next guys. I'm ready to get into this. Let's do this shit. Without further ado, the video will be played right here in this corner. This is Fire Force, episode nine, right now. For all we know, he was the cause of this, this inferno and that one, for all we know. I love that. Oh, that gives me all oh, that the chills. Damn. Oh, watch out, Shinra. Damn. God, he Falcon pushed him. He's one of them. God damn. Oh, come on, get him, Shinra. They be punching the shit out of each other. Oh, good catch. <laughs> okay, that's what I like. Keep me going. Long run on names. Run on. Go back to the flames. He can't just leave because if he leaves, Shinra's going to tell him about this. So it has to end right here. What is the Evangelius? Ah. That's the best place to land at. Uh, now it's not the time, babe. <laughs> oh, 
What? How did that even happen? <laughs> oh shit, she ain't got no skirt on. Oh, that's oh she thick as a oh she thick as hell. Now come on, you can't be doing oh back to it. Oh, I kissed her. <laughs> Yo man, Shiro's the man, but he's getting all the good shit right. He's getting all the good shit right now. Just stand behind like a pillar or something. Oh shit! Oh, that's oh, not. That's oh, oh, this is so awesome. Yo, let's go! This will make a badass arena fighter, dude. I'm not gonna lie. Everything's a foothold. Come crashing down with an axe kick. Oh, right in the mouth! Right in the fucking mouth! Makes sense. But he should be. Nope. He's not done. I don't know. A part of me feels like he might try to blow this whole place up with him in it. Come on, man. We're nine episodes in. In the great flame of fire? What the fuck? Into a second son? What the fuck is wrong with him? You have no right to say that. Oh, it's Karm. Good save, dude. Dude, his voice actor is amazing. He didn't want to do it. He didn't want to do it, but... Dude, Rekka's voice actor is fucking amazing. I'm not gonna lie. What the? He killed them? Who? Who did it? Assassin? I had to kill him off. We couldn't get the job done. Oh! Oh! We'll let them go for now. Yeah, overheated. <laughs> I say thick, right? Thick, right? Alright. That's it. Oh, it seems like the episode just started. Alright, what we got? Okay, so that's not what I thought was going to happen. Yes. Yes. She's a part of. She's a part of Special Company Eight now. It's for his. It's for his man's over there. 
guys there you have it that was episode nine of fire force another fire episode another fire episode now okay so i know you guys were wondering about the uncut reactions yeah i usually don't put uncut reactions for a uh, seasonal anime like don munchie dr stone and this uh etc etc but uh, you know, Fire Force these last two episodes, Fire Force has really been really good, and I just got man, we all got we got we just gotta watch this together from start to finish. Um, so I, I won't guarantee every time I can do it, with, with, I'll do this with Fire Force, but just doing the really really good episodes like this and last week, I wouldn't mind doing it. You know, it, it'd be so worth it to watch it with you all all the way through. Um, this episode right here, another great episode, man. The Evangelist. That I hope I'm saying that right, Evangelist. Uh. Cause I think about Neon Genesis Evangelion, uh, but uh, so I just say it seems like it seems like it's a cult. It's like a cult of people. It seems like a, like or an organization. Whatever those two snipers were, a part of they probably a part of that that same that same front right there. So yeah, and uh, and Rekka was a part of it too. So yeah, they're, they're, I guess their goal, you know, turn people to infernals. You know, pretty much turn the whole world into an infernal. It over time and it then thus in turn turning the world into a second sun, which is crazy, which is absolutely crazy. What nobody would be alive if that's the case, or whatever it is like that's just the premise of their plan. Who else is behind us? We don't know. Um, it, I know, I know it, it has to evolve, um, it has to evolve, involve uh, show you know, Shinra's uh, brother, it has to uh, involve him somehow. I wonder who's behind all this, man. Cause yeah, it was a guy. It was some person. Some person put a bug, you know, on their mother's back back in the day and turned him into and turned her into an inferno, burnt the whole place down. So it made me just wonder. At first, I was wondering how long has Rekka been doing this. He, he was probably a newly recruited, and he's been told, you know, if you fail your mission, you we're gonna, we're gonna off you. And uh, yeah, that's what happened. You know, he got frozen solid by by Karim, and you know, after that. Shot him right through, killed them. It's it's crazy. They don't nobody want. To, they're not going to talk. They they rather yeah kill them off than have them tell anything else about it. Just oh my god, such a great episode. And Tomiki, the Tomiki moments, such a work of art. Her thickness is art. I love it. And how she always ends up getting groped and or touched by Shinra in some type of way is hilarious but hey you know it, it, it's she's meant to be his girlfriend you know what I'm saying later on down and uh man Tomoki is baby girl she really is baby girl thick and everything I love it I love it she is best girl uh besides all the the fan service showy parts she can be she really can be best girl um so yeah man that's pretty much it another great episode man can't wait to get into more of the story we're gonna have episode 10 next week I hope to see y'all there. And uh, yeah, if you liked it, leave a like, comment, subscribe if you're new. And I'll be sure to see you all in my next one. Sayonara.